At a public air show last weekend, Taiwan's AH-64E Apache attack helicopters were on display with a fresh tiger shark paint scheme that astounded spectators. As reported by Taiwanese News, on September 24th, the Army's Huku base in Sinchu County hosted an open house called National Defense Knowledge Tour 112. The event attracted about 110,000 attendees to enjoy ground and air demonstrations, military equipment displays and achievements, military interactive experiences, and a fair. The event showcased active duty equipment, including reconnaissance helicopters, battle tanks, Patriot missiles, armored vehicles, self-propelled howitzers, attack helicopters, and fighter jets. Two AH-64E Apaches, painted in low-visibility camouflage with tiger shark's teeth, eyes, and stripes, became the highlight, attracting people who eagerly posed for photos. On one side of the tiger shark's mouth, a tank can be seen crushed by its jagged teeth. In an ambitious plan to modernize its armed forces, Taiwan has recently announced its indigenous sub-program. Citing remarks given by the head of the program, Reuters reported that the island hoped to deploy at least two new, domestically developed submarines by 2027. Later models will be possibly equipped with missiles to strengthen deterrence against the Chinese Navy and protect key supply lines. President Tsai Ing-wen initiated the program when taking office in 2016. She is expected to launch the first of eight new submarines on September 28th, under a plan that has drawn on expertise and technology from several nations. A breakthrough for diplomatically isolated Taiwan. Admiral Huang Shuquang, Tsai's security advisor, who is leading the program, said a fleet of 10 submarines, which includes two Dutch-made submarines commissioned in the 1980s, will make it more difficult for the Chinese Navy to project power into the Pacific. Huang this month told an internal briefing on the project, which was attended by Reuters, if we can build up this combat capacity, I don't think we will lose a war. According to Huang, the first submarine costs 49.36 billion, 1.54 billion. It will use a combat system by Lockheed Martin Corp and carry U.S.-made MK-48 heavyweight torpedoes. It will enter sea trials next month before delivery to the Navy by the end of 2024. For subsequent models, Taiwan will leave space for submarine-launched anti-ship missiles, but adding those weapons depends on production availability in a U.S., where capacity was already tight without naming the companies that might be involved. He called the submarines a strategic deterrent to Chinese warships crossing the Miyako Strait near southwestern Japan, or the Bashi Channel that separates the self-ruled island from the Philippines. Huang said, This was also the strategic concept of the U.S. military, to contain them within the first island chain and deny their access. He added, If Taiwan is taken, Japan will definitely not be safe. South Korea will definitely not be safe. Don't forget to comment in the section below to share your opinions on today's topic with us. Make sure to like and subscribe to see more interesting topics from Understand China, and thank you for tuning in.